Let me start by saying this is a flagship project for this government and the president has been very passionate about saving uh, for the future. I know NSSF has been the fund that has been taking care of this uh, and maybe challenges have been there before and what we want to speak to are the contributions that are made to NSSF. The 200 shillings that is paid by the worker and the employer is not enough to be able to save for the future. We have seen the challenges that beneficiaries have at the end or at retirement. They are not able to get uh, those benefits because maybe the fund is not enough. It has not been invested uh, in income generating projects. The, but I think the savings have been earning very low interests, so the returns are not enough to be able uh, to make meaningful benefits to the uh, beneficiaries. However, I think we should look at what other countries are doing. When I looked at Uganda, looked at Tanzania, we are proposing in Kenya to raise the contributions to about 6% of, of the pay of the workers. Across in Uganda, it is about 15%, 16%. So we are not even yet there. But we want to tell our people to save for the future. When we save more, we are guarding uh, that future by having more uh, contributions. The other thing that I know is that the contributions that we make is not pegged on the salaries that Kenyans have or the workers in Kenya uh, get. For example, the person who gets um, a salary of one million still pays the 200 shillings. Really, uh, we need to increase depending on the amount that a person is earning to be able to have better contributions and have a better uh, 